I'm lead instructor Jay Hinthorn with Box 1971, where we're changing the culture of the fire service, one fireman at a time. I want to give a quick shout out before we get into the training minute to uh, St. Florian Clothing for building these wicked awesome hats. Uh, they are hand woven. Uh, they do have an adjustable chin strap. They do make kids hats. They sometimes paint them. If you want, they'll put a custom shield on the front. Uh, find them on the interweb there. Uh, St. Florian Clothing, or you can find them on Facebook with St. Florian Clothing. they got some cool t-shirts, too. And if you have a mustache, they've got a really cool one. Uh, but excellent customer service, and they communicate very well with everyone who uh, communicates with them. So with that being said, let's jump into something we want to talk about here at Box 1971 for the September training moment, and that is communication. It's the cornerstone for any and all relationships, whether it be professional, uh, romantic, uh, or just friendship. It, it's absolutely vital. And if you don't say the right things, you sometimes end up with the wrong result, even though in your mind you think you're right. Uh, for instance, in a large metropolitan city years ago, a young probationary fireman uh, said that, hey, Lou, are we going to go back to the station? The lieutenant then asked the, the young candidate to leave the apparatus, and he sent him on his way, jogging behind it. They went to every firehouse in their district to show him that it was a firehouse. Trains, radio, and cops all have stations. Firemen have firehouses. We need to learn to get the vernacular correct. Okay, Just like a truck is, is not a truck. It's a piece of equipment or an apparatus. The truck has an aerial main, doesn't carry any water. Quints are five, and they don't really work that well. And you've got engines that provide water or tenders and tankers as well for big water. But one thing that we really stress here at Box 1971, since Chief Scanlon is now a retired fire chief, is the bugle concept. You know, oh, he's got too many bugles on his collar. It's kind of humorous because bugles are for Boy Scouts, okay? In the fire service, we have what's called a speaking trumpet. This is the precursor to the modern-day megaphone. When the chief would arrive on scene, this is what he would speak into, and he would give direction, okay? It is a speaking trumpet. It is not a uh, bugle. So you'll see five uh, trumpets on his collar for chief of department insignia. Okay, We need to learn to get the small things right. Because remember, a bunch of small things equal one big thing. And if we can't do the small things right, how are we ever going to be able to do the big things right? So be sure to check us out, box1971.com, or find us on Facebook. We'd love to train with you. If you have questions, reach out to us. We'd love to help you. Again, we're trying to change the culture of the fire service one fireman at a time. And if this maybe strikes a chord with you, let us know. Take care, be safe, and have fun.